Welcome to Narvi Academy. In this video, I am going to discuss some important points about ISRO which are given here. Let's start. ISRO stands for Indian Space Research Organization. ISRO is a space agency funded by the government of India. The vision of the agency is to harness space technology for national development while pursuing space science, research and planetary exploration. ISRO was founded on August 15, 1969. The headquarter of ISRO is situated in the city of Bengaluru, which is in the Indian state of Karnataka. Now let's discuss about spaceports of ISRO. There are two main spaceports of ISRO which are used to launch a satellite. A spaceport is a special place with all the facilities to launch a satellite. First one is Satish Dhawan Space Center, Sri Harikota, Andhra Pradesh, India. Second one is Vikram Sarabhai Space Center, Thiruvananthapuram, Kerala, India. Now let's discuss about the launch vehicles of the ISRO. A launch vehicle is used to send a satellite from Earth to the targeted orbit in the space. The first launch vehicle of the ISRO was SLV-3 used in 1980. After SLV-3, ISRO developed PSLV, Polar Satellite Launch Vehicle to place the satellites into polar orbits and GSLV geosynchronous satellite launch vehicle to place the satellites into geosynchronous orbits. On 5th June 2017, India launched GSLV Mark III geosynchronous satellite launch vehicle Mark III. It's an advanced version of GSLV and it is the heaviest rocket of ISRO which can send up to 4 tons heavy satellite. Now let's see some of the important achievements of ISRO. The first satellite built by the ISRO was Aryabhata and it was launched by the Soviet Union on April 19, 1975. The first satellite launched by the Indian Med launch vehicle was Rohini in 1980 by SLV-3. On 22nd October 2008, ISRO sent a lunar orbital Chandrayaan-1 which discovered water on the moon in the form of ice. On 5th November 2013, ISRO sent a Mars orbital Mangalyaan which entered Mars orbit on 24th September 2014, India was the first nation in the world to succeed on its maiden attempt to reach Mars and also India was the first nation in Asia to reach on Mars. On 18th June 2016, ISRO launched 20 satellites by using a single launch vehicle. On 15th February 2017, ISRO launched 104 satellites by using a single launch vehicle PSLV C-37 and it was a record in the world. On 22nd July 2019, ISRO sent its second lunar mission Chandrayaan-2 to study the lunar geology and distribution of water on the moon. Now let's take a look about South Asia satellite. It is a geosynchronous communication satellite. It was launched by ISRO on 5th May 2017. It was the gift satellite by India to the Sark nations. It was sponsored by the government of India. Now let's see about the applications of satellites. The satellites are used for communication, resource management, natural disaster forecasting, radio networking, weather forecasting, etc. Indian Army also uses satellites for surveillance and battle management. ISRO also working on human space flight program. 
ISRO is working on the program to send the human space flight since 2008 and expecting to send it on 2022 as mentioned by the Indian Prime Minister in his Independence Day address on 15th August 2018 and the name of the human space flight will be Gaganyaan. That's it for now. We will come back with the next topic. Till then keep watching Narbi Academy.